Let's talk women talk. Hi, I'm Sharmila, and in this program, I'll be sharing with you how my divineness scares my diabetes away. So join me in the journey of healing through food and belly dancing. In this episode, we will be dealing with how to deal with emotional strength when you are being confronted or being told about certain uh, chronic illnesses. When the doctor first diagnosed me with diabetic retinopathy, I really didn't know how to react. I felt that I had no emotion at that point of time because um, I was not ready to put such a heavy news in my heart, in my life. I need to cry, I need to deal with it, but I'm going to deal it with style. I need to rise above all this. So I need to push aside this problem first and focus on myself because I love to dance and belly dancing brings me so much of joy and when you have joy, when it gives you hope, it gives you the strength. So when you start loving yourself and you want to leave, then you can look at that problem. So I'm going to bring you on a journey to heal through love, joy, belly dancing and most of all, live your life as a diva, no matter what circumstances it is. In today's episode, I'll be showing you on how to do a belly dance exercise to build up your emotional strength. Now the first step I'm going to teach you is called the hip thrust. And this is how a hip thrust will look like. First of all, you have to bend your knees. Yeah, do not straighten your knees. Just bend a little bit and just move your hip to the side here and move to the side here. You can put your two arms, your two, your two palms here and just hit the palm, hit the palm, hit the palm and hit the palm. So it all depends on how big the movement you want to be. It depends on how much you hated that, that, that person. As for me, I, I'm going to hate diabetes so much, I'm going to give it a, big, a bigger movement. So I'm going to go hit, 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 harder. Yes, that's right. Now that you have learned on how to do the hip thrust, you need to frame your fingers as well so that you look nicer. So what you do is, imagine you're holding on to a cherry. Yes, because cherry is high in vitamin C. So, what you do is after you frame it up, you just go right, left, hit, hit, hit. You see, vitamin C will strengthen your immune system and then no way diabetes can come near you using your hips to tell them, go away, go away, go away. And remember to smile. You need to bring in joy when you exercise and when you have fun. So, if you are ready, let's fight the sickness and bad news with sexiness and confidence. Music, please. Okay, and we're going to start with single hip thrust and double hip thrust. And we're going to go single, 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 single. Right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. And double. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Have your cherry, have your cherry, have your cherry, have your cherry. With double hip thrust. One, single. One, 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 one. And I hope I've got you started on the journey of healing through belly dancing. 